Hello and welcome back to Your Relationships Matter. I'm Tisa. And I'm Dr. DJ. And this week we are talking about our goals. You know, it's funny, we all have some. We, we spend a lot of time at the beginning of the year right. writing them all out. I'm going to get this done by this um, part of the year and by April I'm going to have this done. Yeah. So we're talking about our goals. Often goals don't get accomplished unless it's something that you're sick and tired of. I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. Yeah. That's, a, that's a powerful motivator. Sick and tired is one of those things that will send you from here to there. <laughs> uh -huh. It really does. It gets you started. And so oftentimes as we're working with people and they're setting goals, they're saying they want to accomplish something. You have to focus on what the passion is behind that. Is there a true desire to get it done? Or is it just something that, that this is a nice to have? If it's something that a nice, that's nice to have, it'll stay that way. Yeah. And to me, I see it like directions. You know, you got a point and you're trying to get somewhere and you call or ask somebody, how do I get to wherever you're trying to get to? Yeah. First question they're going to ask is, where are you? Mm -hmm. And then once you realize where you are, well, how did you get there? <laughs> and then you have to backtrack the traces and to backtrack yeah. and yeah. everything. And once you realize how you got there, well, you should have turned right a mile ago or something like that. So mm -hmm. to me, those are ways I see in planning and yeah. making goals. I find out what it is I'm trying to get to. Yeah. Who can I ask to help me get there? Mm -hmm. And where am I? And how did I get here? You and know, once you start asking questions like that, you're on your way. I think so too. It, it, it helps to like break it down into mm -hmm. directions. Yeah. So you, you know, you never, so nobody ever tells you to just get on the highway and then get off and you'll be there. Mm -hmm. It's always make a right here, make a left here. Yeah. And those are just breaking down the task into attainable um, goals. Mm -hmm. So you have to have those milestones set up of, okay, I'm, I'm trying to do this, but before I do that, I'm going to make my mark right here. Mm -hmm. So like with um, losing weight, you don't say I'm going to lose 100 pounds, you say I'm going to lose a pound a week. Yeah. I'm going to focus on breaking it down that way. And you know, when you're traveling, Rose, using your uh, illustration, when you're trying to get from one place to another and somebody gave you directions so you turn left here and then go by another mile, turn right, you know, the motivators for me on that trip is the sign. Get into the house. Awesome. Yeah. And, and, and there are signs that let you know I'm going <laughs> in the right direction, you know. Yeah. Cause you told me I'm going to pass McDonald's down at the corner. And then when I get, keep going a little further, there'll be a car wash on the left. Yeah. And like you just used losing weight. Losing weight, you know, it might you might not be able to tell you lose weight until you put on those pants like, oh, you know, these things are not me. You know, yeah. And that motivates you, yeah. okay, I was getting ready to go. I was getting ready to go and give me a wobble. Now I'm gonna go and give me a salad. <laughs> <laughs> want to thank you for tuning in this week here at Your Relationships Matter. We are your personal source for motivation, education, and strategic information. Check back later this week for more on attaining your goals.